Hi guys! In today's video I'm going to give you some very helpful ways to strengthen your embouchure and improve your climate sound. Having a good tone is super important because it's the first thing people notice when you play, so it has to be as beautiful as possible. Playing long tones is very useful to have a better sound because one, they really help you to develop your embouchure muscles and this is great news knowing that the sound quality is heavily dependent on the strength of your lips. And secondly, you play slowly so you will have more time to think about all the bad habits you can correct. The idea is to bring your new good habits into your usual playing so that you always have a beautiful sound. Ideally, it's good to do these long tone exercises as a warm up and I would suggest you to do that for at least 10 minutes every day. But also when you play you should <coughs> always think about... Pure uh, music, I have a question for you. Yes? Like, why? Um, Why should we practice every day? 10 minutes? No, no, I can explain minutes. you if you want. Please, please. So as I said, your lips, uh, like any other muscles of the body, you need to exercise them every day. You need to keep them in shape. So, it's super simple. And don't worry, I can guarantee you that over time you will see a tremendous improvement of your sound. Tremendous. Uh, so, let's get started. <laughs> Here are four ways you can play these long tones. For the first way, pick a note and keep it at the same dynamic level and the same quality of sound until the end. You can also play in different registers. One useful tip when you practice is to look in the mirror to check your posture, to make sure your shoulders, your neck are well relaxed and your hands well in place, for example. The second exercise is to start pianissimo, then go until fortissimo and then down to pianissimo again. Try to keep the tone and the pitch as steady as possible. Also make sure that your crescendo is as controlled as your decrescendo. This one is not so easy to keep always the good tuning and the quality of the sound. The two other exercises are to play the notes a bit shorter. For now, let's try with C major. Try to be as smooth as possible as you switch notes. And the last one, do the exercise with intervals. And again, the idea is to try to be super smooth. Now I will play in thirds. Focus on your air being super steady. In these sort of exercises, you want to avoid having bumps or gaps in the sound like this. Try to be as smooth as possible. So these are the four ways to play long tones. With time you will see that all the good habits you will create with these exercises, you will be able to incorporate them naturally in your repertoire. Like having a good air support, a good position of the embouchure, being relaxed and so on. Make sure to try those, I'm sure it will help you. Don't forget to like, to subscribe and also you can follow me on my Instagram. See you guys next time.